hello friends uh, in this video we will learn how to plot uh, a graph which is having uh, one x axis and two y axis and also we will learn uh, two different uh, graphs in a same plot uh, for uh, different x axis so let's start doing this one so this is our you can see this is our origin window I already put some data so this is x axis this is y1 axis and y2 axis what it means means this will have uh, two y axis uh, and one x axis and we will plot using that one so <coughs> uh, whenever you have the comparative data uh, you can uh, use this kind of uh, plots in various journals also you can see and this is the uh, uh, best way to represent two comparative uh, data. So, before starting, please like and subscribe my channel. And please subscribe my channel by using your Gmail or Reddit ID. Don't subscribe it by using your uh, university ID. So, let's start doing next one. So, uh, here I have put the x data y1 and y2. This is the standard format. You can uh, directly, when you put the data, you can. Uh, directly plot it so just select it and uh, plot it so you can go this multi curve so here you can see double y so you can click on here so see this is your double y so this blue line is representing this y axis and this black line is representing this y axis so this is your uh, two y axis data suppose now you want to change the format of this suppose you want it uh, in dash line so just select this one okay and you can take this line okay so you can see the symbols has been removed still you want to modify uh, this line so what you will do you can change color okay you can see you have changed the color so here the color is also changed now you can change the width so you can change width also if you want to change the style so you can make it dash if you want to change the symbol from here so you can also change okay and if you want to change the type of symbol okay so you can uh, do like this just double click on this line so here you can see symbol so you can pick any symbol like this apply and okay now you can see the symbol has been changed so here you can change the width there are various options and if you want to change the uh, I mean symbol size so you can also change the size of symbol symbol is uh, 8 so we we'll make it 15 so apply it we can check okay so the symbol size looks very big uh, now if you want to change the color of the symbol you can change the color blue color like this okay so you can see the symbol color is blue the line color is black if you want to change the line color so you can change the uh, line color blue and you can see here this y axis is changed so this is your x axis and this is your this is your y1 axis and this is your y2 axis like this you can uh, draw your uh, graph when you are having one x axis and two y axis okay uh, if you are having suppose uh, you are having one more y axis suppose y3 is there y3 is there and you will take any random data uh, 6 8 10 12 14 16 or 20 So this is our random data so uh, here you can see now go to the plot take the multi curve okay so here you can see three y axis so like this now you can see this black line is showing this x axis okay this one this is the scale the blue one this is the y scale and the red one this is the scale y axis okay so if you want to uh, format similar way you can format here you can change the color make it green 
like this or you want to make it brown so you can gray make it brown this is the blue one suppose you want to make it black so see similarly the axis is changed so you have your uh, lines uh, accordingly you can uh, format i hope you have already seen uh, this kind of figures in uh, general papers so this is the way to uh, plot uh, the graph now let's come to the uh, another plot suppose uh, this is x axis okay uh, let me copy it i already changed it so let me copy it we will add one more book so here you can see this is our book here we will change uh, engaging the columns so you see x y y y okay so if you right now if you plot it so uh, let put some data so this is uh, a okay and this is b uh, a1 a1 this is b and this is b okay so if you right now if you plot it suppose you plot it so you will get some random plot okay like this this is the x axis and we got this so what i want to say uh, suppose this is x and the respective y is this and this is x and respective y is this so how you will do this is x respective y is this so it's okay a and a1 for but b you we need to make it x so we will do, uh, uh, select it we will select it right click and here you can see set as so we need to make a x now you see this is x2 and it automatically become y okay now if you want to plot it so now if you plot so this uh, y1 will be uh, with respect to this x1 this y2 will be with respect to x2 so just take and if you plot it so like this so here you can see this is the value it was changed so this is the graph if you want to do it like this in same scale same x axis you want the, both the y graph so you can like this and if you don't want to do like this you want in uh, same graph okay so what you will do you take go to the plot <coughs> sorry multiply so here you can see vertical two panel so like this you can do okay this is the x respective y x respective y like this if you want to uh, do it more way okay so how you, how you will do is that line by y offset you also uh, you cannot opt sorry you cannot opt for uh, this option okay so uh, here you can see a stack so like this okay so number of plots in each layer is one okay make it one now you can see both the plots are there so this is your x scale this is the y scale okay so this was your first graph okay where x scale is there both the uh, means uh, this was your book okay so this is x1 this is y1 x2 y2 so here 1 to 10 is a scale and 8 to 20 is the scale so in, in graph you can check 1 to 10 you are getting this and 8 to 20 you are getting this graph okay and in this one different uh, x scale and y scale both are different but the graph will be same and same here okay and suppose if you want to change the font so just similar way as i have already told you in my previous videos you can make it like this just make it make it bold whatever you want to do you can do <coughs> make it like this okay only the thing you need to do separately this is a separate graph this is the separate one so you need to do separately okay hold it hold it so see this is your x-axis for this is the y-axis here this is the x-axis and y-axis generally this is the best uh, representation to uh, show your uh, data uh, in general papers this will be uh, good if you are having two x-axis and two different y-axis so i hope uh, you got uh, how to do uh, this kind of uh, plots so guys if you like my video please like and subscribe my channel thank you